morning here from Trondheim in Norway. Things here look pretty much the same as when we went to bed. Nothing really changed. Still about the same level of brightness here, so yeah, something we have to get used to, I think. So yeah, today we have uh, about 800 kilometers to go until we get to the Lower Fort Islands. So uh, probably be able to do about 500 kilometers today. It's slow going here in Norway, it's no motorway, it's just uh, a road. So we'll get back in the car, pack the tent away and uh, get back on the road. Just found a place to stop for lunch on the way to the Arctic Circle and the sun has come out. Ah, for that. First time today. The view okay? Mm. So Med has gone from seven layers of clothing yesterday to what year? How many down to now? Down to two now. Two layers? Whoa, the mid is getting hot. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie's made the sun come out. Now we are 300 kilometers from the Arctic Circle. That's where we started this morning. And there we are. Driven up there. And we're standing right there on the border to the north of Norway. So this here is the border to the northern part of Norway, not the Arctic Circle yet, that's still another 263 kilometers north from here. Ah, now we arrived here at the Arctic Circle. Well, not sure whether we get here today, but uh, yeah, we managed it. So, yeah, at this point, from this point, the Arctic Circle here, it's uh, light on the uh, summer solstice. It's like 24 hours a day here, and on the uh, winter solstice, it's dark for 24 hours a day here. So, for at least one day of the year. The more north you go from here, the more days it is. Uh, with 24 hour daylight. It's not actually a fixed point, it moves about 15 meters north every year. This is due to the uh, the change of the, the tilt or the axis of the earth that it's changing. So now we're crossing the Arctic Circle. Mm. Up in the snow here. <laughs> oh, the tent is up. Yeah. Took a bit of time, but we managed to find a free place to camp this evening. Let's park the car there. The good thing about camping, you put the tent right on the front row. Why, are you, why are you not fishing? Because it's not allowed. <laughs> why? I get it. Came too early. Two days too early. So, I said about second day here on the road in the car in Norway. It's actually uh, quarter to 11 in the evening now, believe it or not, even though it looks as, as light as it normally does in the daytime. But, uh, we're now about 20 kilometers north of the Arctic Circle. Um, so, just found a camping spot here. And tomorrow we have about 120 kilometers more to do until we get to the ferry port in Bodo. 
which will take us over to the Lofoten Islands. Not sure whether we can cross over tomorrow to the islands because we just, we just heard from another guy uh, camping over there that there's a 10 hour queue at the ferry port for people waiting to get over. So we're not sure whether we'll park the car somewhere on a campsite and then uh, jump on the bikes and then it'll be easy to get to the front of the queue and jump on the ferry. We'll see it's, uh, what we do. But, uh, we'll make it up as we go along. But, uh, somehow we will get over to the Lofoten Islands. But uh, yeah, that was the end of today. A yeah, nice spot here. It's uh, allowed to fish for salmon here from the 15th of July. So we're just a couple of days early. It uh, looks like a great spot for fishing. The people over there, they're already waiting uh, for the 15th. So they've got their, their spot already. So, uh, but yeah, that was it. We'll uh, sleep in the tent now in the full daylight. <laughs> and uh, see you on the road again in the morning.